How Adam Demos Films His Sex Scenes for Netflix's Sex, Life Actor Adam Demos revealed why it felt so mechanical to film his sex scenes on Netflix's hot new show, Sex, Life, co-starring Sarah Shahi and Mike Vogel. As steamy as sex, life looks to the untrained eye, star Adam Demos says it's really not all that sexy to shoot. The 36-year-old Australian actor was asked on The Kyle and Jackie O Show what it's actually like filming sex scenes as Brad Simon on the Netflix show. It's not, I mean, hopefully it looks convincing, but it's so mechanical, it's ridiculous, Adam shared. He explained that it's not as glamorous as some might think, saying, people ask if you get carried away. But you've got sound guys and cameramen right around you with the big beards. That's a bit of a turn off. The hosts then asked if his co-star was nude while he was there filming. No, not at all, Adam replied. It's a closed set, but you've got modesty. I look like a Ken doll, which is embarrassing. However, the falling in love star was, in fact, new for his spiciest moments. Sex, Life creator Stacey Ruckheiser, who previously worked with Adam as a writer and producer on Unreal, told Collider that no. That's not a body double in that shower scene. I mean, people usually ask is it real or is it a prosthetic? Stacy said, though she didn't quite answer that one, saying. And I can tell you what Adam Demo says about it, which is, a gentleman never tells. So, we are leaving that up to the viewer's imagination. He previously told Entertainment Weekly that he was okay with being nude on screen. Because he read the script and knew what he was getting into from the start. As Adam explained, that doesn't mean you can't have discussions about comfort level. which they allowed us to have, and with the intimacy coordinator, so it felt a lot safer. As Netflix describes of sex, life, a woman's daring sexual past collides with her married with kids present when The bad boy ex she can't stop fantasizing about crashes back into her life. It's based on B.B. Easton's 2016 memoir, 44 chapters about four men.